Traditionally known as Creole bread pudding, this bourbon bread pudding hails from New Orleans. The French, African, and Spanish settlers in the area were known as Creoles, and their influence on food and baking has made New Orleans a go-to destination for food lovers. This bread pudding is a quick and easy, last-minute dessert that makes good use of milk, sugar, and stale bread and other store cupboard staples. Using real Kentucky bourbon is going to give it that authentic, smoky kick, but you can use any whiskey you like and it's going to taste wonderful. You can find the full recipe in the description below. Let's begin by preheating the oven to 175 degrees and greasing a tin or baking dish with butter. Using a freestanding electric mixer with the whisk attachment or a handheld electric whisk, we're going to beat together three large eggs until they're frothy. To make the custard, we'll add in 215 grams of golden castor sugar, 950 mils of whole milk, one teaspoon vanilla extract, and half a teaspoon of grated nutmeg, and mix it all together until completely combined. You want to use freshly grated nutmeg rather than ground nutmeg because it's so much more powerful, and you want to have that heady aroma bringing out the spices in the bourbon. Trust me, it's gonna smell great when it's baked. Now take 500 grams of stale French bread. You wanna cut it up into two to three centimeter cubes. We're gonna add the bread and 165 grams of juicy raisins, which will plump up and add a delicious fruity caramel flavor. Pour the mixture into your bread and get your hands in the bowl and mix well to completely cover all the bread. Set this to one side and let the custard soak in for at least 15 minutes. Pour the mixture into your butter, tin, or dish and press down firmly so that your bread sits evenly. You don't want too much bread breaking the surface because the edges can catch and burn easily in the oven. We'll bake this for about 45 minutes. While your pudding is baking in the oven, we'll make the irresistible bourbon whiskey sauce that's going to be poured all over. To make this, bring 295 mils of water, 100 grams of light brown sugar, and a quarter teaspoon of grated nutmeg to the boil in a saucepan. You'll want to set this over a high heat to get things bubbling along nicely. To make it into a sauce and add thickness, we're gonna mix one and a half teaspoons of corn flour with our bourbon. We'll be using 60 mils, which is a bit more than a double shot in the UK, as we don't want it too strong. Remove any lumps you can see with a fork or whisk and add this mixture to the hot water and sugar in the saucepan. At this stage, it's important to whisk it well until it thickens slightly and it's smooth, which is gonna take around eight to 10 minutes. Take it off the heat and stir in 30 grams of unsalted butter. This is gonna make the sauce lovely and glossy. Now it's time to pour the bourbon sauce all over the bread pudding and do serve it while it's still hot. Once you dig your spoon in, you're not gonna be able to stop. You can find the full recipe in the description below and subscribe for more videos. Tweet us your bakes at Humming Bee Bakery or find us on Facebook.